Hello everybody and welcome to Nocturne Cow. Let's play Portal 2. 2-2. Two, two. I don't know. Anyway, so us and this bitchy potato are going to continue on towards the exit and other puzzles with weird gels that do things. Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. For staggering your way through Aperture Science's propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. For many of you, I realize $60 is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go spending it all on, I don't know, Carolyn, what do these people buy? Tattered hats? Beard dirt? Such an asshole. <laughs> he is such an asshole. Like, I understand that over the course of the test so far, we're, we're spanning. We're spanning like 20 something years, I think. Like, this starts in the early. sometime in the 50s. Now we're almost at the. well, at near the end of the 70s. And during that time, he had into some trouble because of his testing methods. It's not a safe testing facility. I'm sorry, it is not. I'm not surprised that they, 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 there was a that all the fancy people disappeared, and or no new fancy people want to come here because of it. And look at all this salt. Anyway, <laughs> it's just so mean to the homeless people that, that they used after that. Like that's so sad. It's so sad. And what's that? I heard a weird noise. I'm just gonna continue on. That was... yeah, okay. I mean, after science is, is, is an odd place on its own, but I was... I wonder, like for those of you who have played this game, or seeing as you've watched me play through the first game and now most of the... I think we're like a little, little over halfway through the second. I feel like there's not that much... We're at least, at least a third, if not more, of the way through this game, I feel like. I don't remember exactly how long this game actually is. Anyway, but given the way things seem to work in this feeling in a way, it's, wouldn't it make sense for there to be like... Excuse me for a second. Uh, oh, excuse me. Wouldn't it make like, sense that one of these days they would have like one of those scary outbreak type of things happen in this facility? Like third game is you're somehow you, you get trapped you're trapped in here again or whatever like however they would manage to you might even be a different person actually you could be a different person in the third game like some other random uh, Joe Schmo who has also been cryogenically frozen gets woken up and has, has to travel through this facility after some kind of viral outbreak and then uh, like, you're not only trying to like solve the puzzles and get through the test chamber but you're also like trying to like fight off these like creepy monster things I feel like they could make this into a good horror game thank you for not lo loitering longer than 20 minutes oh, okay thank you thank you we, we appreciate your um yeah also I did call call it that this was 70s like look at this tile I'm all for yellow but like <laughs> come on guys uh, I guess we're just gonna continue this way. And then there's a, what's it say? All forms must be filled out legibly and completely for, before uh, eligible to receive payment of $60. What if they can't write and, uh, spell? Ooh, okay, so they would have to wait here because people would take the time to do things. Ooh. See, like, right here. There could be something hiding here. I could hide here while monsters run by. Just be like, uh, you, you can't see me. Come out and, like, make a break for it. Or something. I don't know why. I'm like, I think this is such a good idea. Uh, let's see. Please excuse the inconvenience. This elevator is out of service until unknown. Motherfucker. Uh, this person... There's a little TV. I want to watch TV. Let me watch TV. They let me watch TV in other video games. They do. I watch TV in Alan Wake all the time. Motherfucker. Alright, so we gotta use portals to advance, I guess. Um, oh, 
probably something up there. There's, can I just get over there? And portal there, and then I portal here. Yep. Chairs are in my way, but you know. I kind of want to go that way. Gamma. I'm pretty sure I don't want anything to do with gamma radiation. But yeah, we're going to walk over here because I want to see if there's something up here. I feel like there might be something over here. I don't think there is, but I'm curious. Nope. There appears to be nothing here. And of course the elevator has surface is busted. God damn it. But yeah. Um... I don't know why this is here then. I guess theoretically you could have put a portal up here and then you would have came out here and then had to walk. Because, you know, I'm like, where was that supposed to go? This used to be a pathway. Where was this pathway originally supposed to go? There's nothing over here. Like, there's nowhere for that pathway to connect to. go to wherever Gamma... Uh, gamma is 82, so a few years later, so I need to find a way to get to Gamma. Uh, they skipped a lot. Wait a minute. Are these supposed to be in alphabetical order, right? Alpha, Beta, um... So we skipped like four. Are there like one of these a year, maybe? <sighs> okay, let's see here. I mean, clearly I could portal something over here. Maybe there's portal surface right there. Where is the other one supposed to go? Is it a portable? Yes, it is. Alright, that was easy. Ah, god damn it, wrong color. It's, fu it's, w it's funny how some of this game I'm like, alright, what is this complicated thing you're going to want me to do? And I'm like, oh wait, no, it's something really simple and easy. Never mind. Carolyn, 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 why do I know this woman? Did I kill her? Or... Oh my god. Uh, like, your phrasing is weird. You're doing a great job. Can you handle things for yourself for a while? I need to think. I've been doing this all- you haven't helped been helpful at all, bitch. Like, what if you help- how- I, you, you know what, you do you, I do- I'll do me, and we'll just say fuck off. Alright, um... Alright, there we go. White. The arrow is white. So that means the next flow we're gonna get is white. There's some random orange up there. Hmm. All right. Uh, we're gonna have to turn these on. All right. Yeah. So we have our jumpy glow, our jumpy goop, and then we have our speedy goop. Now we have whatever this white goop is. Yeah. Cluster fuck going on over here. There's 
white goop there that we can portal on. That's what white goop is. White goop is more portable surfaces. Yay, portable surfaces. Woo! Okay. Uh, Remember this part? I hated this part. I died a lot in this part. Okay. Okay. There is no portal service over there. Uh, go! Ah! Oh shit, I got it first time. <laughs> yes! Okay. Uh, door! Door. I like doors. Doors are fun. I think she has a phobia now. <laughs> Get over there. Right, that's centered. That's centered, right. Yeah! Suck it, bitches! Suck it! Suck it! Alright, um... Caution, watch your step. Thanks. Thanks for the advice, brah! Thanks! Welcome to the Enrichment Center! <coughs> brah, you alright? Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, you may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. The bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less seventy million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. And guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're going to see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, Make lemonade. <coughs> Let's all stay positive and do some science. That said, I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Aww. He's sick. It means he's going to die soon. Okay, I guess we're jumping down here. Just go look at this. Walk up. Yeah, that's that door. Alright. This is what he looks like now. Yeah. Um, time has not been kind to you, buddy Bowie. But then again, I feel like making yourself a test subject probably didn't help. Uh, let's see. What is this? Mm hmm. Hmm. Carla, the complainer, says, my new boss is a robot. Yeah. But did you know? Robots are smarter than you. <laughs> Robots work harder than you. Robots are better than you. <laughs> Volunteer for testing today. Okay. Uh, remember, robots don't sleep. They can test and do your job. Volunteer for testing today. 
Oh, oh okay. That's, uh... Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I'm assuming I have to do something with this button. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Aperture science. Let's work together. People and robots. It's not even a good looking robot. It's a badge that is so photoshopped. Okay. Uh, test subjects, waiting area. Okay. Uh, uh, some probably some sort of a promotional thing of a bob. Waiting for attendant. What does it say? Caution. Rem remote. Remote activated door. Wait for. Okay. Warning. Do not test if you are allergic to lunar sediment and or starch. Okay. Uh, you have fulfilled your monthly test self election quota. Uh, you are confident enough in your work performance to volunteer from the what? From the test self election process. To unvolunteer. Okay. I don't know why I just heard volunteer, not unvolunteer. Okay. Alright, I get what they're saying. Okay. So this is when they started testing on their uh Co-work on their f employees, and eventually they test on their employees' family members because we found our thing earlier in the game. So pretty sure we're the daughter of one of the people who used to work here. With the whole bring your daughter to work thing. And that's how we were captured. saying. Okay. They never explained what the orange stuff was or what it was made of. We know what the uh, blue stuff was and now we know that the white stuff is a lunar rock something or another. Um, of the white goop everywhere. Everywhere, I say. Everywhere. Yeah, it doesn't look suggestive at all. Ah! Right in the face. Right in the face. doing. covered in this stuff now. Alright, well we're out of that little room now. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Where are we supposed to be going?
that looked important. Mm -hmm. I do not know what I just knew. Getting this stuff everywhere. I don't even know if it's useful. I'm just doing it. Pretty sure I'm supposed to uh, put on the portal there. And jump into one down here. So. There. Figured it out. Got up here. Alright. Now this should be high enough for a fly jump. Yeah. Okay, so we want to come out there. And then we're just gonna... Banzai! Motherfuckers, we made it. When yes! life gives you lemons, don't make lemonade. Make life okay. take the lemons back. Get mad! I don't want your damn lemons! What am I supposed to do with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. Make life rue the day it thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemons. I'm gonna get my engineers to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down! Burning people. He says what we're all thinking. The point is... If we can store music on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Well, if we want you on a disc, you're kind of intelligence. We should have been off working the rails. On it 30 years ago. I will say this, and I'm going to say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. Very if much. I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. Okay. <laughs> now she'll argue. 
She'll say she can't. She's modest like that, but you make her. <coughs> Hell, put her in my computer. I don't care. All right, test's over. <coughs> you can head on back to your desk. Goodbye, sir. Yeah, he's insane. He is batshit crazy. He should not be running a facility. <laughs> Thank you for your volunteering. Please return to your desk and uh, await further or uh wait. Further opportunities. Sounds like orders? No. What if this person has to test? The person who's supposed to keep track of who tests and who doesn't. Elevator to surface! Elevator to surface! Um. What am I zooming in for? Those stones, that, that wall thing that kind of looks like two people having a conversation. Because I'm sure that's interesting. 300 meters below? Is that what this is? I'm 300 meters below. Has a lot of portable surfaces. Uh, what am I supposed to see? There they are again! This exact same pattern, which kind of looks like a person. And then another person. That's over here. There's one over there. There's another one over here. Well, that's only the one guy. And over there. I guess they use r repetitive stuff for their programming. Alright. Um... This is the elevator shaft. Uh, I'm supposed to figure out how to climb. All right. Uh, there. Give me. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Please don't collapse. Please don't collapse. All right. place for an office to be in my opinion. But alright. That's the one thing. They have they have offices tucked away in really weird odd places. I don't understand. Alright, so we are over here. Alright. And we wanna get up. Here, I guess. I don't know. Can I get higher? Can I get that one? I don't think I can get that one. That one might be a little bit too far away. guys. We're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, another office down there, but it doesn't look like they do anything. Um, yeah. Making our way up. Um. 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 
That didn't help. Mm. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Alright. Bonsai. God damn it. Where am I? Where's the outdoor? There it is. Yeah. But I don't know where I'm supposed to go. That's where I'm supposed to be going. Alright, um, so let's. I want blue. Alright, I'm gonna want orange for the next one. Sorry if you guys are getting nauseous, but you know. Do 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 do. Ha! Victory is mine. Yay, guys! We made it. I think maybe we're we're somewhere new. We've gotten somewhere new. Let's see, what is our next thing we got going on here? I know things look bleak, but that crazy man down there was right. Let's not take these lemons. We are going to march right back upstairs and make him put me back in my body. And he'll probably kill us because he's incredibly powerful and I have no plan. Well, I'm not going to lie to you, the odds are a million to one and that's with some generous rounding. Still, though, let's get mad. If we're going to explode, let's at least explode with some dignity. I mean, I can't really argue with that, Gladys. I mean, if we are going to die, we might as well die fighting. That's basically... I mean, that's been my motivation this entire time. I'm going to fight until the very last second. And I just happen to sort of be... Kind of winning. Sort of. Maybe. Kind of. Sometimes. Okay. Well, um, I'm going to end it here, you guys, and we're going to figure out how to go out of here next time on Dr. and Cal Let's Play Portal 2. I'll see you all guys later. Have a good one. Bye-bye.